ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ್ವ ಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದು ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕಾ ಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನೋ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಛಾಕಲ್ಪತರುವಶ್ಚ ಕಿಪಾಸಿಂಧು ವಿವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗ ಪಂಗುಂ ಲಂಘಯತಿ ಗಿರಿ ಜತ್ ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂ ಬಂದೇ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವೈತೂಸಿ ದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಸಭಕ್ತಿಪದೇ ದೇವೀ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರಂಚ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವೀಂ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತೂಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ವರನ್ನು ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವ ವಿರಂಚನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ಭೀತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪನುತಪಾಲ್ಲುಭವಾದಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೆ ಚರುಣಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನ ಖಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗಪವಧೂಷ್ವದರ್ಶ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗ್ರಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮೈ ಕದಾ ಕಿಫಾನ್ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀ ಅದ್ವೈತ ಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀ ಅದ್ವೈತ ಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕಾ ಬುಧಾತ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈ ಕವಿತರು ಕಮಲಾಯುತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜರೌ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ಬಂ ಬಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರಿ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದುಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ಬಂಧಿತೋ ದಿವ್ಯೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಾಸಿತ್ಯಂ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷೀತ ವಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯಮನಂಗಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶ್ವನಾಥ ಬಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ಯ ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ ಚ ಭಕ್ಷಿ ಯಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬೀದ ಸಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಪ್ರೇಮಾಂಜನ ಚುರಿತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ವಿಲೋಚನೆ ನ ಸಂತ ಸದೈವ ಹೃದಯು ವಿಲೋಕಯಂತಿ ಯಂಗ್ ಶ್ಯಾಮ ಸುಂದರಂ ಅಚಿಂತ ಗೂನ ಸರ್ವಂ ಗೋವಿಂದಮಾದಿಪುರುಷಂ ತಮಹಂ ಭಯ 
प्रेमांजन छुरी भक्ति विलोचन सत सदी हृदयेश विलोकयी यंग श्याम सुंदरम चिंत गुण सर्वम गोविंदमादिपुरुषम तमहम भजाम गौड़ीय गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठग प्रभुपाद जगदगुरु टोल बॉन्डेड सोल बाय हिज पर्सनल एफर्ट कैन नॉट अरेंज मंगल गौड़ीय गोष्ठीपति श्रीशील भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठग प्रभुपाद परमंस जगदगुरु टोल बॉन्डेड सोल कैन नॉट अरेंज मंगल बाय पर्सनल एफर्ट If they at all try their best to arrange mangal in their life, they do just opposite. In the name of angal, in the name of mangal, they do just opposite. They fall down. So for absolute mangal, we will have to depend upon Guru Vishnu, no other way. Because it is the arrangement of Bhagwan. it is the arrangement of bhagwan bhagwan arrange the distribution of bhakti through his own devotee by your personal effort we cannot get bhakti i was speaking bengali hari katha just now previous hindi hari katha really it is impossible for bonded soul to arrange mangal so they will have to depend upon guru vishnu they can arrange mangal many time i told before that only will power is reserved with krishna only will power all other thing they resting with balaji maharaj only the will power krishna is a will have only will power all other thing krishna and abaldaji maharaj controlling everything if shakti if sarup shakti is staying inside bhagwan then it is called when sarup shakti is staying inside bhagwan it is called shakti but when sarup shakti coming inside us i mean devotees it is called bhakti when sarup shakti is staying inside bhagwan it is called shakti when that shakti somehow coming to us i mean devotees it is called bhakti and sarup shakti and bhakti non different same swatantra all dham you see this dham navadip dham vrindavan dham all dham all balaji maharaj संधनी शक्ति संधनी शक्ति भगवान अरेंज ऑल दाम एवरीथिंग इटर्नली प्रेजेंट इटर्नली प्रेजेंट बट स्टिल कमिंग फ्रॉम बल महाराज सहस्रपत्तम कमलम गोकुलाक्षम महत्पदम तत्कर्णिकारम तत्नतांश संभव ब्रह्म संगीता ब्रह्म संगीता इज द मोस्ट ऑथेंटिक scriptural evidence brahma sangita is the topmost you know i mean authentic book why because brahma watching you will have to rely upon guru vishnu na you cannot see a prakriti jagat you cannot see a prakriti jagat you will have to depend upon the kripa of guru vishnu by your personal effort you cannot see dam nam nothing you can see uh, nothing possible all by the mercy of guru vishnu balaji ji maharaj sandini shakti this all dam everything arranged by him i already told brahma is not speaking any story brahma surely not speaking any story why mahaprabhu speaking brahma sangeeta is the most authentic scriptural evidence why why mah why mahaprabhu speaking because 
He is Supreme Lord. Non different from Nanda Nandan Krishna. Actually, Brahma is going to watch everything. Chatu Sloki Bhagavata, you know, no? Chatu Sloki Bhagavata. Jnanam paramam guhyang me yad vijjana samannitam sarhasam tadangancha gihano guhitang maya. Jabanaham yathabhava yad rupa guna karma kaha tathiva vijjana mastu te madanugrahat. By your personal part you cannot see. Madanugrahat. I am best of kipa, you can see. In front of Brahma, Bhagavan speaking. All secret knowledge relating to my Leela, Dham, Nam, everything you can know. Jnanam paramam guhyangmi yad vijjana samannitam yad vijjana samannitam not Jnan. Vijjana means realization is there. When direct realization is not there, that is not Vijjana. Vijjana means you are 100% sure it is because you have your feeling. So, what Brahma watching? All about Dham. Brahma not making any story, not making any philosophy. What Brahma watching? Brahma going to speak us. That is, that is why it is more authentic. Brahma watching. Bhagavan giving darshan of his Dham, Nam, everything, everything. All Leela, then Brahma watching. After that, Brahma writing. So, jnanam paramam gujyam vijyat vijyana samanitam sa rahasyam, all secrecy. Secrecy means most secret, most secret things. It is called bruja prem. Rahasyam mala, the relationship between Radharani and Krishna. Sa rahasyam. Tadangancha, grihanu gujitam maya. I am speaking, you accept. Javanaham Jathavava Yadrupa Guna Karma Kaha Tathiva Vigyana Masutya Madhano Grahat Aho Mibasa Mibagra Nanajya Sahasatpram Paschadaham Jadetvacha Jaba Sisa Sosmiham Riti Artham Jat Pratiyata Na Pratiyata Chatmani Tad Vidvat Atmana Mayam Jathavasa Jathatmaha Jathamahanti Bhutani Bhuteshu Chabachishanu Pravishanu Pavishtani Na Teshu Na Teshu Big explanation Chatusloki Bhagavatam, you can discuss for long time. So, Dham, I cannot see by my personal effort. Dham is Chinmay Bastu, Vrindavan Dham, Navadip Dham. I was speaking just morning time, I think, I was speaking. One dust particle from Golok Vrindavan or Vaikuntha is more valuable than then all the summation of this material world, infinity. Infinity material world, you can put one side, and one dust particle from positive world. So now you understand. This is the case. So one dust particle is not so easy. We are always going to think about the valuation of building, land, or gold, or silver, all, we are always going to estimate. But how you can estimate, how you can estimate the cost of one dust particle from dam? Can you do? One dust particle, you have no calculation. Any kind of estimation, anything, all failure. You cannot. That's why Uddhavji Maharaj, that's, that's why Uddhavji Maharaj wanted to get one dust particle. Brahmaji also. Brahmaji also speaking. I want to get one dust particle from Brajadham. Who can give me? Rare. Forcefully you cannot get. So it is written, Brahma, actually Uddhavji Maharaj speaking, I want to get one dust particle from them. I mean the dust particle from the lotus feet of those gopikas. Brahma speaking. I tried my best. I gone through austerity as penances for a long time. Thousands year. But I couldn't get. Brahma speaking. In Shastra it is written. 
And Uddhavji Maharaj speaking, Asa maho charana renu jusha mahamsam vindavane kimapi gulma latao shudhinam jadustajya sujjana majya patancha hitva bheju mukunda padavim shutivim bimigram. All suti siti, they are all searching the lotus feet of Krishna or the dust particle from the lotus feet of Radharani. They are searching. That's why Uddhaji Maharaj is speaking, I want to get one dust particle. One dust particle from Bhajyotha. Or if Bhagavan allow me to take birth, or if Bhagavan allow me to take birth in Brajadam as a creeper, creeper, you know, creeper. Still today, <coughs> it is not story. Still today, <coughs> You can find Uddhavji Maharaj in Uddhav Kunda, in the bush. Kripa, na? Kripa bush there. Still today, Uddhav Maharaj can come out to give darshan, provided you have 100% faith. Because I am not making any story. In Bhagavad glorification, in Bhagavad glorification it is written, when Braja Mahishis, rest of the Braja Mahishis, some of them already at the time of Krishna's disappearance, they are only gone, some of them adopted, some. So, they wanted to meet with Uddhavji Maharaj. Because Uddhavji Maharaj is the fittest person. Tomorrow morning I can speak. Why Uddhavji Maharaj is the fittest person? Bhagavan wanted to keep him as a representative in this material world. He is the fittest person. 100% Uddhav Maharaj is going to follow, Uddhav Maharaj is going to follow Krishna. Uddhavji Maharaj is going to follow Krishna in total. Not only that, but also in living condition. In living condition, Uddhavji Maharaj taking the form of Krishna. Living condition, he is alive. He is taking the form of Krishna, totally Krishna. Only Kostuba Muni, that jewel is not there, Shiva, Sachi, you know, these two symptoms. All other, all same. Tomorrow I can discuss this point. When they wanted to meet with Uddhav, Uddhavji Maharaj, to hear Bhagavad Katha. Because Uddhavji Maharaj, Uddhavji Maharaj, going to accept all the teachings of Krishna. Morning time I am discussing now all the last two teachings, the last two teachings of Krishna to Uddhavji Maharaj. The last teaching of Sri Krishna Bhagavan to Uddhavji Maharaj before leaving this material world. That's why they all, Parikhit Maharaj, all they are busy to hear Bhagavad Katha from, but where we can get? Then Shandila is speaking, well, if you can pray, if you can start Sankirtan, if you can start Sankirtan in an enthusiastic way, with full energy and mind, then automatically Uddhavji Maharaj is bound to come out. This is the formula. They started doing Kirtan with Kartal Midanga heavily. Oh, full Krishna Sankirtan. In the meantime, Uddhavji Maharaj appeared from the push. Uddhavji Maharaj appear from the bush. Then they are dancing. Uddhavji Maharaj comes. Then they request Uddhavji Maharaj agree to speak Harikatha anyway. Uddhavji Maharaj still today is there. Still today you can find. Our Sachidananda, I want to establish the gravity of Dham Parikram. First of all, introduction. And what is Dham? What you can get? Bhakti Mnod Thakur, before leaving this material world, Bhakti Mnod Thakur, before leaving this material world, wanted to give instruction to Vimalapasha Saraswati. Bhakti Mnod Thakur wanted to give instruction to Prabhupada. 
that you will have to arrange Dham Parikram. You will have to arrange Dham Parikram, you will have to arrange the you know, total arrangement of Dham, so that people can feel attraction to come. Dham Unnoyan. Actually, this word, uh, development of Dham, this word is not applicable. I don't like to use. Because Dham is Dham. But Bhaktivinoda Thakur wanted to speak in with some other, some special idea. Dham is Dham, we know. Reformation of Dham, reconstruction of Dham, how possible? But Dham is Dham, but Bhaktivinoda Thakur wanted to indicate to Prabhupada, if you arrange so much facility in the Dham, so outside people can come, outside, anyway, outside people can come to take darshan of Dham, they can get prasadam, there should be so many temple, school, everything. This is called development. Bhaktivinoda Thakur wanted to arrange. Dham Parikram you will have to do, and we, you will have to establish all Daiva Varnasram. It is not related with this discussion, but still, when I am speaking about what Bhaktivinoda Thakur told, so I am going to cover. Actually, it is not related with my dham. This point, this point, specially. Bhaktivinoda Thakur wanted to, wanted to give instruction to Prabhupada that you will have to arrange Daiva Varnasam. Daiva Varnasam means? Which is Daiva Varnasam means according to your behavior, according to your nature. According to your nature, according to your nature, you can become Brahman. According to your nature, Daiva Varnasam. Not that he is the son of Brahman, so he is Brahman, not that. Daiva Varnasam means what is the nature you are getting according to that. Rishi Muni all wanted to indicate. So many documents in Mahabharat, in Puran, even in Bhagavatam, Jasho Yat Lakshanam Praktam Pungsho Varnabi Vanyakaha. Tadanna to this. Deshad, you know, Tate Nuiva Venir Deshad. According to Tata, you will have to discover, you have to understand who is Brahman, who is Kshatriya. So, Vaishnavas, those who are pure Vaishnavas, they are naturally Doiva Varnasam. Those who are Vaishnavas, they can never be compared with Brahman. Because Brahman is Brahman. But in Vaishnava, there is Brahmanism automatically there. Because in 100 rupees, 10 rupees automatically there. Within 100 rupees, 10 rupees already there. So no question of any argument. So Vaishnava mean is already having all the qualities of Brahman and not only that, but also some excellent qualities. Because Krishna Bhakta can get all the qualities of Bhagavan. It is written in Chaitanya Charitamrita, Krishna Bhakti, Krishna Gun Sakali Sanchari. Krishna Bhakta can get all the qualities of Bhagavan, quite natural. But surely not a devotee can get the power to do Rasa Leela or creation, not that. Which is exclusively reserved. This kind of creation power or doing Rasa Leela is exclusive. This was completely reserved by Bhagavan. So Krishna Bhakti Shakali, Krishna Bhakti Krishna Gun Shakali Sanchari. Krishna Bhakta can get all the qualities of Bhagavan provided, provided they can maintain the qualities of Bhagavan. Not that they can get the qualities of Bhagavan and they become Bhagavan. Not that. Follow what I say. So, Joshu Jat Lakshanam Praktam Pungsho Pungsho Varnavi Venjagaha Tadarnat Dishet Tate Nuiva Venirishet. According to hereditical conception, if you at all find one Brahman boy, it's okay. According to hereditical uh, conception, if you can get one Brahman, is Brahman boy, is Brahman, okay. But if you cannot find, then be sure you will have to apply, you will have to apply Varnasam Dharma. 
I don't do, like to touch this point. So, Bhakti Mirata Thakur wanted to give instruction before leaving this material world. What is this? First, you will have to arrange Dham Parikram because Dham Parikram is the, is the topmost procedure through which bonded soul can get Kipa. Dham is more and more merciful than Bhagavan. Dham is more and more merciful than Bhagavan because Dham is Baldev Tattva, Guru Tattva. Dham is Baldev Tattva. So, Dham is more important. Dham Seva. To understand what is Bhakti, to meet with one devotee, to come in line, to follow all Harikatha, it will take long time. Even people can feel disgusted because they cannot understand deep philosophy. Oh, big problem, what speaking, Maharaj? But it's more practical if you can arrange Bhadda Jiva to do Dham Parikram. And if you can speak the, all the glorification of different places, more practical. But anyway, through Dham Parikrama, they are going to, surely, they are going to get, if they are not going to do any aparad. Especially there is no problem in Navadip Dham, Bhagavan is very merciful in this avatar, but now Vrindavan Dham is not so, very tough. If you are going to make mistake in Vrindavan Dham, the big problem. Bhagavan, Radharani cannot excuse. Chaitanya Mahapu anyway can. So this Dham Parikram, Bhakti Mahaprabhu giving instruction for bonded soul, anyhow, they are not ready to do bhajan. If we, if we can give them facility to do stay, to do parikram, to hear harikatha, because parikram anyway, they are coming for seven days. Not that they can hear and go back. Seven days they can get the opportunity to get satsanga all the time. Baba speaking, they can get continuous satsanga. Uh, they are doing kirtan, they are doing harikatha, speaking so many things. Or they can go to different places of this dham, they can explain. This way they can get kipa. So Bhakti Mira Thakur wanted to give instruction to Vimala Prasad, my Prabhu, you will have to arrange dham parikram. It is the best possible way to arrange mangal for jiva. And after that, Bhakti Mira Thakur speaking, Daiva Varnasam first, dham parikram and Dham Unnayan, development of Dham. I mean, to attack people. Don't take it other way. So, Dham is very important, Baldev Tattva, and it is very important. If you don't understand, there is very big problem. That all Jiva, their Sarup, they are troubling. Their, their Parikram is in their Sarup. You are doing parikram now? You are doing sansar parikram. Don't understand me. You are doing sansar parikram. You are taking birth, again going to die. Again, so you are doing parikram also doing your. It is the nature. Bonded soul always doing this. For infinity period. They are doing parikram. It is the nature. So when we are going to give them opportunity to unveil their secret sarup, by doing Dham Parikram is more practical. I already told, uh, I mean, six months ago, Jaloja, Navalakshani, Sabora, Vingshalakshati, Krimayo, Ruddha Sankaka, Pakshinam, Dasalakshakam, eh? Pashabo, Trinkshat Lakshani, Chatur Lakshani Manavaha. I told, na? you can remember, you, you are writing there. Forget, so foolish. <laughs> Six months ago I was speaking. So anyway you are traveling. Sometimes you are taking bath as the aquatic element, animal, Why? whale, octopus. Eh? This way you are taking bath. When you are taking bath in Africa forest as a tiger or jackal, who knows? Can you give any guarantee? I already told, na? Jadava Charja, I told that day. Ramanu Charja, a small boy, Lakshandeshi. A ghost going to overpower 
that the daughter of the king of Madurai, king in problem, only three days is there. After three days, four days, marriage ceremony already ready. Uh, now ghost going to catch. Who can marry my daughter? Big problem is there. Big problem is there. So this way, this way actually, this way actually what happens? What I say? Just no. Huh? Huh, Lakshman Deshi. Lakshman Deshi actually, there, and Jadavacharya also there. The ghost going to full concentration. Ghost going to speak, if you can give the water wash of the leg of any devotee, I can go away. I can go away. Then a ghost, uh, then they are suggesting, we can give the, we can give the water wash of Jadavacharya. No! Cannot take water wash of Jadavacharya. Why? Uh, he is not Vaishnava. He is Mayavadi. And he was, uh, he was one snack. <laughs> you can go mad, little in there. Ghost can see everything. Ghost speaking, Jadavacharya was a snack previous life. Only by taking the Uchishta, only by taking the Uchishta of Vaishnav, now he becomes, he getting Brahman body. Ghost speaking. Previous life he was a snack. So useless. If you can give the water wash of the lotus feet of this small boy, I mean this, you know, Lakshman Deshi, then I can do. Then they feeling it derogatory? Well, he's a teacher, big professor. And the student is very small. From then onward, jealousy started. From then onward, jealousy started. Well, I am the professor, Brahman. I am going to teach you Vedanta. And the ghost speaking that you can give the water was this, uh, this uh, small boy. It is derogatory. He's feeling very Insult, huh? then he is growing, he is growing, gradually growing some jealousy. So many cases I was speaking that day. Anyway, so previous life, still previous life, still, still previous life, we cannot say. You can say? Previous life? You cannot say. So, this way, we are all jivas doing parikram. All jivas. Non-stop parikram. Krishna voli shei jiv anadi bohirmu. Atayev mayatare deik shangshara didu. For infinity period. Parikram is there in our nature. We cannot stop parikram. Oh, we can change the mood. We are doing sangsar parikram. We can just convert it in dham parikram. This much we can do. This we can do. By Dham Parikram, be sure 100% Kiba. I can give document, direct document. Still today, Ashatthama, you heard the name of Ashatthama, the son of Dronacharya, the mighty man, Baba. Ashatthama still today doing Dhamma Seva. In Vrindavan, I've been there. I went there, the place. But you cannot see Vasatama. Ashatama sometimes can come out and give darshan, not always. Ashatama. So Ashatama actually still today. Still today, Ashatama doing bhajan there. In Pishai Gaon, northeast portion of Nanda Gaon. You have to go long. There is one village. There is one booth. There are very few people. A very few people. They are going there. Not everybody. They don't know. They have no information. Ashwatthama doing. Because Bhagavan, anyway, Bhagavan was not at all ready. I am going to the glorification of Dharma. Anyway, Bhagavan was not at all ready to excuse. Anyway, Bhagavan was not at all ready to excuse because he is going to commit big Vaishnava Pura. 
He is going to kill five sons of Draupadi. They are sleeping. As with the cutter, going to cut, 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 cut that. Five sons of Draupadi. They are sleeping. And he is coming and cutting the throat. So big problem. Many aparad he already done, Asatthama. Asatthama done so many aparad. First of all, he wanted to kill Panchabanda. Okay. Second, again, there is going to launch Brahmastra when? When our Parikhit Maharaj was there inside, I already told na, in the womb of, in the womb, inside the womb of Uttarama. Wanted to kill. This way, Aswatthama is going to do so many opera, which can never be excused. Bhagavan was very, very angry. Like the case of, you know, uh, Mahaprabhu, not uh, Chapal Gopal. When Chapal Gopal crying all, all leprosy disease, you know, please excuse me, please best of kipa, you? This is nothing. This kind of pain, suffering is nothing. For infinity period, for infinity period you will have to suffer. I am not going to. Because you have committed opera and to lotus of Sivas with my heart. So Bhagavan anyway not going to excuse. Finally those Munirishis, he is consulting with Munirishis. They took decision. They are requesting, well, Bhagavan is not going to excuse you, so you can go to you can go to Vrindavan Dham and serve Vrindavan Dham. So, well, if you are going to serve Vrindavan Dham, today or tomorrow Bhagavan is going to excuse you. When Jagai Madai wanted to wanted to ask, confirm, when Jagai Madai wanted to confirm, Prabhu, you excuse me, really? How I can know you excuse me? How you excuse? I can excuse. You can excuse. How we can realize you excuse? Well, if you can give seva, dharma seva, Bhagavan gives. Okay, you can clean this jagai madai. You can clean this jagai madai gut. You know jagai madai gut? Clean. Jagai madai gut there. It is the name is jagai madai. The so, jagai madai taking permission from Bhagavan to get some Dhamma Seva. So, I know so many sadhus. I know so many sadhus. They are penniless. Only by doing Dhamma Seva, they are getting the lotus feet of Krishna. Still today, they are secretly staying. They have only one instrument, only one instrument, that is boon. Boon, you know? Clean, clean. And they are cleaning Dhamma, Kunja. Kunja, you know, Radha Govinda Kunja, they are cleaning. They are sitting like, sitting very humbly, like our Samananda Prabhu. Samananda Prabhu, what Seva doing? Samananda Prabhu, Samananda Prabhu used to do Dhamma Seva, clean, all with boon, clean. And by chance, get the an 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 ankle belt of Radha Rani, Manju Ghosh. Samananda Prabhu cleaning. Cleaning, mad niduban. In course of cleaning, he discovered it. He's taking up. So you dam seva is so important. Dam seva is so important. Even Bhagwan not going to excuse you. Still, it you can get excuse today or tomorrow. If dama, I mean, dama is non different from Bhagwan. I mean. So, if Dham is going to excuse you, that means Balaram is going to excuse you, Krishna is bound to. If Balaram is going to excuse you, I mean Dham Tata, who is non different from Krishna. So, when it, one example, when they wanted to break the head of Nityananda, blood coming, though the body of Nityananda Prabhu is not built up of blood and flesh, but still it is Yogamaya. When Mahaprabhu wanted to call chakra wheel, Sudarshan, Sudarshan, and Jagai Made watching, the wheel coming to cut us. 
Jagaimada watching, who will come? Ah. But Nityananda is going to catch Bhagavan. In this incarnation, avatar, you promise that you are not going to catch any will. We are not to catch. You are not to accept any club, will, or cutter. Why you love Krishna? All avatar, all demigods or god, you know, Narayan or they all have some weapon. But Krishna no weapon. Only one fleet. Only one fleet. No weapon. Because Krishna is not going to apply any weapon. All, you know, the demon and witch, you know, Putana, all they killed. But not by the help of any weapon. Weapon is that. Also, there is more deeps. There is deep philosophy. Actually, Nandanandan -nanda Krishna never killed. Nandanandan Krishna never killed Putana. Nandanandan Krishna never killed Tinavarta. Shakotasu never. You know Krishna killed. Someday I can give documents. In Krishna avatar, no vaibhav appliance is going to touch. Appliance is there. Appliance is always like to subscribe. Appliance is always waiting to subscribe for any Krishna Hila. But Krishna Nila is not oriented with all done by Chaitanya Charitamrita. You can find Krishna Vishnu Dare Krishna Kare Osur Sangharan. Bengali, it is written. Externally, you can find Krishna going to kill. But Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami writing in Chaitanya Charitamrita, actually, Krishna not killing. It is written clearly. You see Krishna killing. Vishnu Dare Vishnu. By the help of Vishnu, Krishna killing. Vishnu, where from coming? Vishnu already there in Krishna. Vishnu already there in Krishna according to time and circumstances. Vishnu can come. All Agasur, Bhagasur, Putana, what not, everything. All killed by whom? Narayan, Vishnu, not Krishna. But nobody knows. They think it's done by Krishna. No, Krishna is not touching anything. Krishna always busy with this, you know, Madhur Lila. Madhur Lila is the predominating factor. Madhur Lila is the most predominating factor in Prajodham. Opulence is there, but opulence cannot exceed over power. If there is at all opulence, but still, Madhurja is going to cover up. Opulence is there. Opulence is there, surely. Opulence is there. But Madhurja is going to cover up the opulence in such a way, you are not going to feel it bitter. You can always sing sweet, sweet, sweet. Appliances never going to overpower Madhurja. Madhurja always going to. So, any Leela you find, Krishna Leela, Krishna Dham, any, always full of Madhurja. Madhurja always there. No problem. Now, the question I was speaking, but the Jiva for infinity period, they are doing Parikram, Sangsar Parikram they are doing, if at all they can do Dham Parikram, they can get free. If you can do Dham Parikram, Temple Parikram, then you can get free of this, you know, life after life, you are taking bath, taking bath, taking bath, again taking bath, even this kind of, this kind of cyclic order can come to an end point. Main point is that those who are bonded soul, they are not going to believe there is some there is some aprakita sakti, aprakita dham. They are not going to believe. They believe in dollar, they believe in their personal efficiency, they believe. They never believe. They don't like to believe. Ah, Guru Vishnu speaking as yes, okay. But from heart, they cannot accept that Krishna is something, Krishna Dham is there, 
ultimately our goal is we will have to we will have to go leave this body how long we can get this body this kind of body how long we will have to leave this body and go take transcendental body we can go to dham to do seva but anyway bonded soul not ready life after life they are anyway they hear you need migration certificate you need na when you are coming from outside if i am from india going to take some take take some money indian money and going to america they can accept my money no they can throw useless if i am going to go to america with some indian money then they cannot allow they cannot allow na they can say oh, useless you will have to give dollar exchange so we vaishnavas we vaishnavas always rely on that aprakita treasure aprakita treasure sampatti property but they don't believe they don't believe they always depend upon dollar these that they can depend but more material na more they are material they always depend upon that but they don't understand if you are going to some other country they can, they can say kishanam can give everything where if i go to market i can say i can give you kishanam you give me uh, 10 kg rice they can give me ha huh? if i go to market if i go to market and say kishanam is the you know is a great property the but the shop but the shopkeeper cannot allow if i say i can give you kishanam you give me 10 kg rice they cannot give they can give no because they don't understand the valuation of kishanam they cannot understand they don't understand that you have money you have property everything if you are going to some other country this kind of this currency this currency is obsolete there similarly when you are going to leave your body who can allow you who can give you you know who can give you passport who can give you you can go there you need some property so while living in this material world we will have to deposit some aprakita property right or not while living in this more material world we will have to deposit some aprakita property that is called krishna naam but they don't believe they don't believe what you know as gravitational acceleration gravitational force you know gravitational force you know gravitation if i throw one object up it can come down why because gravitational force going to catch and is who each two object each two object is this or this or this any object two object any two object in this material world there are some personal interlink but people don't know any two object you have you cannot discover it you don't know any two object in this material world they have some link we cannot discover it all the star and planets there in the sky they have some interlink follow this way there is some kind of force acting force i mean what do you mean by time if i put question in front of you what do you, what is the explanation of time what do you mean by time einstein speaking time is nothing but movement so accurate answer time is nothing but movement knowingly unknowingly we cannot understand all of jay there is some movement there movement there there is some movement movement must be there this is called time 
So in Aprakita Jagat, Bhagavan is there, there is one center point. In this infinity, in this, in, in this infinity world, in the infinity world, there is one center point. One center point. And on the basis of the center point, all moving. On the basis of the center point. But they have no idea. So, now, Dham is a Prakita first point. Dham Parikrama is very important, is also very important point. But how to do? I can go to Dham and do Parikram? You can go and do Parikram? No. I already told, na? A Prakita Vastu Kabu Prakita Gochanoi. A Prakita Vastu, you cannot see by this material eyes. You have to go up. A Prakita Vastu Kabu Prakita Gochanoi. You can go and see, oh, some stone, some stone there is Govardhan, Giriraj Maharaj, some stone are there. You can see this? Or what? You can see. You can go to Govinda Mandir. Oh, very nice. This you can see. But Aprakita Arsan you cannot. Aprakita Bastu, Aprakita Bastu Kobhu Prakita Gochanoi. Material people cannot see anything. So what to do then? We cannot do dham, Dhamparikam. Yes, we can do. We can do surely. But under the guidance of a pure devotee. Because I, if I am standing behind my Guru Maharaj, if I am going to stand behind my Guru Maharaj, then Guru Maharaj can say, this is Chaitanya Mahat, you see, I can see. This is one clue. When Nityananda Prabhu under the guidance of Nityananda Prabhu, our Jiva Goswami Pad was successful to do Dham Dham Parikram. Who doing? Dham Parikrama of Jiva Goswami Pad. Dham Parikrama of Jiva Goswami Pad was done under the guidance of Nityananda Valaram. You forget. So this is one clue. This is one indication. This one indication you will have to follow Balaram and devotees of Balaram. I mean, Nitair in Kirtan we, we sing na Nitair Charan Satto Taharo Sevak Nitto, you know? The lotus feet of Nityananda is eternally present, and all the devotees of Nityananda who is also resting in the lotus feet. Equally important. Equally important. Nitai charan sattva, taharo shevak nitto. Nitai charan sadakara as. Bengali kirtan. So this is one clue. This is one clue that we will have to do parikram under the guidance of Nityananda, I mean under the guidance of exalted devotee. Who is the one messenger who is coming from Dhamma? If I ask you, you explain about, you know, Himalaya. You say, i never been there, and never went there. How you can explain? If you have no practical experience about Manas, Manas Saravar, about Kailas Parvat, if you have no idea, no direct experience, no practical experience about, about Kailas Parvat, Kailas Parvat, Manas Saravar, you can, you can speak? If I like to get some direct information about Nandan Kanan in Himalaya, Himalaya totally, they are demigods, they are going to, they are coming to play there. You cannot go there. All over the world, whatever flower available in the world, all there. But demigods, they are going to play there. They cannot go. Very secret place. Nandan Kanan, this, that. So, if you have no practical experience about Dhamma, Nama, you cannot speak. If you have no realization about Bhagavan, you cannot speak Harikatha. I am not speaking. Bhakti Mahat I am not speaking. Bhakti Mahat is speaking. Bhakti Mahat writing clearly, Harikatha can be spoken by those Aprakita messengers, those who are coming from Vaikuntha Jagat. Bhakti Mahat writing. 
বৈকুণ্ঠ জগতের পার্শ বৈকুণ্ঠ জগতের দুধগণ ছাড়া হরি কথা কেহই বলিতে পারে না বেঙ্গলি ইংলিশ আই অলরেডি টু দোজ ওয়া দ্য মেসেঞ্জার অফ বৃন্দাবন আর বৈকুণ্ঠ দে ক্যান স্পিক হরি কথা অল আদার পিপল ক্যান নট স্পিক হাউ দে ক্যান ইন দ্য নেম অফ হরি কথা দে ক্যান স্পিক সাম ড্রাই ফিলোজফি ড্রাই ফিলোজফি ইজ নট হরি কথা ড্রাই ফিলোজফি who care man to hear we have no time to to hear your dry philosophy we have no time if you have your direct experience about your bhajan you can speak to me. and that direct experience direct realization you can get by the power of gurudev by the power of gurudev nowhere else is possible i can give countless example another example i can give when jagadananda pandit wanted to go to vrindavan to do parikram mahapo said well you don't go there ah, i like to go i like to go prabhu prabhu i like to go prabhu not giving permission why not because jagadananda if going to vrindavan he can cry where is my gaur where is my gaur where is my gaur gaur is there in puri so mahapo not agree mahapo no mahapo no very well if jagadananda the moment he can go from nilachal dam in a road he can start crying where is my go but still jagadananda jagadananda prabhu going to complain sweet complain sweet sweet complain jagadananda pandit going to going to lodge a sweet complain with who rayaramananda Sarva Mata Jaja, because they are their exalted personality, Maharaj, uh, Prabhu respect them very much. If they are going to request on my behalf, if they are going to request on my behalf, surely Ma Prabhu cannot say no. <laughs> so, ultimately, you request Prabhu. Prabhu not giving me permission. I like to go to Vrindavan. I never saw Vrindavan. Prabhu, you give permission. Yes, yeah, Jagadananda want to see Dhamma for a long time, you know. well you can go if you like to go give permission but mahaprabhu is sure that jagadananda can go from me and start crying where is my go anyway he like to go he okay, go but before going but before going mahaprabhu going to give some instruction special before before at before jagadananda prabhu leave for vrindavan Mahapu wanted to give him some special advice. One fraction of second, you cannot leave the association of Sant Thanatan Gosai. You will have to, you will have to stay, you will have to stay with Sanatan. Every fraction of second, don't leave Sanatan. If you at all like to do parikram, you will have to do parikram under the guidance of Sanatan. Be careful. why why you know because sanatan goswami is a symbol of sambandha gyan is a acharya of sambandha gyan if there is no sambandha i can go and walk i can take one car and do ah i have done parikram <laughs> parikram you can get one car or you can walk only you go walking you can get some medical facility for walking your sugar can go down your body can become free this much you can get nothing else parikrama doesn't mean somebody is speaking oh ekadashi fasting is very good i can control my body this is not ekadashi they are doing ekadashi with some mood to keep their body fit to keep their body fit with this modib with this motif they are doing ekadashi fasting is good for health <laughs> but they are not going to think we are fasting we are doing ekadashi only for the satisfaction of krishna is called ekadashi but somebody is speaking this way somebody is speaking this way all their different kind of moods going to drive them actually they are driven by maya they are driven by maya devi they are controlled by maya devi so they are anywhere they are not going to hear me they can follow their 
they can follow their old rules and regulations. So, Dhamparikama is not a matter of yoga. Mahaprabhu giving special instruction, so long as you, so long as you are there in Vrindavan, every fraction of second you can stay with Sanatana. If you at all like to take darshan of different deities, if you like to go to do Dham Parikram, you can do under the guidance of Sanatana. Be careful. Why Mahaprabhu speaking? Nobody else. If I am not going to develop Samanda Gyan, Samanda Gyan Adi Devata, though I know some new people can come, Maharaj, new people, they have no Samanda Gyan. Okay. They have no samandha again. But if at all they are going to do parikram under the guidance of special acharya, those who are enjoying the keep of sanatan, they can give some keep up. Not that everybody can uh, develop samandha again from home. They are coming from uh, Brazil, America, Russia, Poland, who, everybody can have their samandha. Not that. They are coming here, they are coming here in Dhamma to develop samandha again. Not that I can throw, huh? they are no Samandha, so throw. And also they have no clear idea about what is called actual Diksha. What is called actual Diksha, they have no clear idea. That's why big problem all around the world. Who is going to take shelter of whom? And what is this condition? Nobody care. Only external appliances, money power, there's a more... This, uh, this is the scale. This is the scale of measurement. But of prakita vastu kavu prakita guchanvai. So anyway, Dhamparikrama, my Guru Padma used to say, my son, you go to Parikram. Tito Maharaj going. Bhaktivala Tito Goswami under his guidance, you go. I have done Parikram. Under the guidance of Tito Goswami Maharaj, Tito Maharaj dancing. Dancing with Harinam Sankirtan, so the Maharaj dancing, we are also dancing all around. We feel some ecstatic feeling because his parikram is not ordinary parikram. He's acharya, na? Bharti Maharaj can speak about dham, how to do all he can speak, but not that everybody. So Bhakti Tagore used to say, everybody cannot speak Harikatha. Harikatha can only be spoken by those Aprakita messenger, those who are coming from Vaikuntha or Goloka, they can. By your proficiency, by your, you know, knowledge, you cannot speak Harikatha. Harikatha is not such, not such a thing. Also, another very important point, I already told, what is the influence of Guru Vaishnava on us. We are blind, we cannot see. Gaura Ama Rishesava Jesava Stano Karila Brahmano Range Sheshava Stano Heriba Ami Pranayi Bhakata Sange It is the same thing. Already it is, Bhakti Vita Rai. Gaura Amar, Gaura Amar, Are Maharaj, I can discuss tomorrow. Gauranga Mahapu, how doing Dham Parikram? Not along, one Brajavasi is taking. He is Bhagavan himself. He is Bhagavan himself, but still, he is taking one Brajavasi. Ah, he is showing, Prabhu is this, this, that. He is Bhagavan, omnipresent, come on. Omnipresent, omniscient, he is all, all knowledgeable. But still, I can discuss tomorrow. How excellent Dham Parikram. I have my practical experience, like a beggar. I used to do, sleep, eat like a beggar, street beggar. You cannot sleep there. You can fear some snack can come. I am not, I am in Vyasasana. If I leave you, in the night time, one fraction of a second, you can start crying. All darkness, what is here, you cannot see. So deep darkness. No place, only open bamboo structure, bamboo. There I am sleeping. Jackal can come, any snack can come, all around snack. 
But I, in my all parikrama, even one ant, one Scorpio never cut me. Whole parikram, life, no, whole year after year. But never one Scorpio or one snake or one you know ant bite me. It's a mercy. Mercy with full belief, with a stick, I with one stick raining whole water, putting stick and going away. And there is Jundu, you know, that, that uh, there, uh, you know, uh, in the field, there is some special kind of grass, you know, very long grass. I am going to penetrate grass and run. Uh, in between that grass, there can be some snack. With full belief, Bhagavan can protect me. No water, no bread, nothing. Where I can go, where I can stay, who can give me? No thinking. All very bold. No anxiousness, okay? If no prasadam, okay? If prasadam, okay? This kind of mood. So, dham parikram with some majestic arrangement, aristocracy, you cannot do. With some majestic arrangement, or some aristo, you know, if you like to maintain aristocracy, this kind of parikram, you cannot do. Parikram you will have to do like Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Parikram you will have to do like Jiva Goswami Path under the guidance of our Nityananda Prabhu. This is called Parikram. Raga Pandit. Srinivas Acharya Jodan Parikram. Srinivas Acharya Jodan Parikram. Our Shamananda Prabhu Dan Parikram. Northam Dhagur. But all done under the guidance of Raga Pandit. His Gufa Cave. Raga Pandit, this cave is also there. Near Puchri ki Lota. I can discuss a different place, my experience, okay? But it will take year after year. If for 10 years, if we go on discussing about Vajodham, endless. I cannot remember so much place. Follow. So much place, countless. But I can speak gist anyway, so that you can also realize something. Very nice. So, Raga Pandit. Under the guidance of Raga Pandit, our Srinivasa Chajuran Parikram. Oh, so nice Parikram. Oh, Parikram. Oh, nice. So, if you have a no direct feeling, what you can give to, what you can give to devotees? The Thukasimai has a direct feeling. So, he is dancing when? Everybody dancing. Everybody feeling some pleasure. But if you are going to follow one bonded soul as your guidance, <laughs> as your guide, who can guide you? Because Bindavan Dham, you cannot find within the graph and chart map of India, but still it is there. Bindavan, is, Bindavan Dham is not a part of your geogra geographical figure of this world. Navadip Dham is not. They are all loosely attached. They have no connection with the material world. You can find all shop and ho hotel, all Maharaj is there in Dham. Bhakti Mata will no. No. Not in Dham. All hotel, restaurant, all different kind of shops and, and car going. No. It's all, uh, one net is, one net is there. Arranged by Maya. They are not in touch with them. With them, only Prabhupada, Bhakti Vinod Thakur, Bhakti Pramod, Puri Goswami, Siddhar Goswami, they can get in touch with them. But other material people, they cannot get connection with them. They can go. Out of their false ego, they can go. I can go. I buy, I buy the ticket, flight ticket. <laughs> they can go. But this way, they cannot go to them. Sheshavastan, Brahma, I know, Kariwami, I know, Jeja, Gaura Amar, Sheshavastan, Kariwala, Brahma, no Rangi, Sheshavastan, Brahmi, Vami, Pranayi Bhakta, Sangi. What do you mean by Pranayi Bhakta? You know Pranayi Bhakta? 
There can be so many devotees in the world. But who is Pranay Bhakta? Pranay Pranay Bhakta means who has a deep, deep, loveful relations with Bhagavan. Pranay Bhakta means, Pranay Bhakta means they have deep, deep, loveful relationship with Bhagavan. You have to do parikram under the guidance of some Naran Bhakta. If you, if, if, if you are going to South India and catch one Naran Bhakta and bring, you can help me to do parikram of Vrindavan, you cannot do. He is pure devotee, nice. He is not false devotee. Narayan devotee. He is a disciple of Narayan. He is a, you know, his Ishtadev is Narayan. If you can catch him, uh, you come, you can help me to do Vrindavan Pari. No, he cannot do. <laughs> he, is, oh, he is worshipping, he is nice devotee. Maybe he is nice devotee. But he cannot help me. Because he has no direct relation about what is Vrindavan Dham. But how he can help me? He cannot help me. Because he don't know. He never been there in Bindavanda. Not yet. Nobody can help. This way, they cannot help me. In Rasamrita Sindhu, Rupa Goswami writing, in Rasamrita Sindhu, Rupa Goswami writing, that you will have to get the association of a pure sadhu or elevated sadhu from your own sampradaya. From your own sampradaya, you will have to search one pure sadhu. If you are going to get one pure sadhu, maybe from another sampradaya, Ramanuja sampradaya, or oh, say Vishnu Samhita, no. because you cannot get any nourishment, because you cannot get any nourishment of your own Gaudiya Vajan, because they have no idea. Okay, they are sadhu, they can bless you, no problem. This much they can do. But anyway, you are not going to get any nourishment of your Gauriya Bhajan. That's why Rupa Goswami Bhad repeatedly told that Sajati Rasa Snigde Sadhu Sangu Satu Vari. You know na? the sloka from Rasamrita Sindhu. Sajati Rasa Snigde. Try to understand the meaning. Not that Sajati, okay, that devotee is sannyasi, you know, okay, you can guide me. Not that. Rupa Goswami is clear, going to clarify this point. Rupa Goswami is going to clarify this point. Sajati Rasa Snigde. Your goal and my goal should be same. Then if you can come to my Harikatha, they can enjoy. If your goal is this direction and my goal is this direction, so right matching, so right matching of guru and shishya, disciple, is very important. Right matching of guru and shishya, disciple, very important. I was speaking now in Brihad Bhagavatam Dutta. Shukdev Goswami and Parikhit Maharaj, the right combination. Shukdev Goswami and Parikhit Maharaj, the right combination. Well, right, perfect. The kind of speaker is rare in this universe, infinity world. The kind of disciple like Parikhit Ma who can listen to your Harikatha with full enthusiastic mood, rare. So, in the Shastra, in your uh, scriptural evidence, we find the name of Parikhit Maharaj as a disciple, and, I mean, who is going to hear Harikatha with full attention, is number one, idealism. And the speaker, Shukdev Goswami. Sri Vishnu Smarane Parikshit Abhavad Bhayas Kikirtane. Pallada Smarane. I told many times this sloka. So they are the idealism. Nobody can break, nobody can break their record. Never. Nobody can break their record. Because it is from Bhagavatam we find. From Bhagavatam it is speaking. The topmost idealism of, he, of hearing Harikatha is Parikhid Maharaj. Topmost idealism of speaking Harikatha, absorbing mood, is Shukadev Goswami. Who is going to break their, who is going to break their, you know, their record? 
So Sajati Rasa Snigde, Sadhu Sango Satovare. Anyway, we'll have to get one nice sadhu who is of same Baba. You, if your Baba is separate and my Baba is separate, then no right matching. You cannot get enjoyment. Follow what I say. If your Baba, I mean, I know you are weak. Okay, weakness is not a big problem. But at least there should not be any kapat Baba. Kapat. There should not be any kapat bhav. Follow what I say. Weakness, okay. Weakness can be there. And for that, Guru Vaishnava is sitting in front of you to cut all your weakness. That is not a... But you are going to uh, lose your faith in Guru Vaishnava. That is the main problem. You have no faith that Guru Vaishnava can do anything. If I can satisfy my Bhakti Purigasi Maharaj, what is not possible? What is possible, you don't speak. If I can satisfy Pahupad, Bhakti Vinod Thakur, and Siddhar Goswimath, Pahup, and our Guru Maharaj, Bhakti what not possible for me? What not possible, everything possible for me. Though I am not qualified, but quality can come from Gurudev. He can sit inside my hand and speak Harikatha. Siddhar Maharaj, Bhakti Vinod Thakur, Keshav Goswimath Maharaj, all they are helping me. That's why I feel inspiration, enthusiastic energy to do Harikatha, Harikatha. Never feeling tired. I have no time. If I can speak 8, eight to 10, I can speak, I can speak. Night time, 8 to 10, I can speak. But I have no time. I have to do my number of Harinam, these, so many things. No time. That's the, time is the main thing. I am not feeling tired. Main point is time. How I can make up my time? That is the main problem. I have to go and do everything. I cannot, without uh, completing my bhajan, I cannot take rest. And even morning time I'll have to run. So big. That is the main. So, sajati rasvay snigde, sadhu sango satobare, it means, sajati means, from your own sampradaya, from your own sampradaya, by the mercy of Nithananda, by the mercy of Gauranga, you can get such an association which is more than sufficient. You cannot digest this kind of Siddhanta. If I depend upon Prabhupada, Prabhupada can go on speaking so many things I cannot digest. It is beyond my capacity. So speaking is not problem, but you will have to digest also. Only speaking and speaking and speaking you cannot digest. Uh, you can l develop loose motion. Loose motion, <laughs> big problem. Very good. So, Sajati Rasa Snigde, Shadu Sango Shatubari, you must realize. Sajati Rasa, from your own Sampradaya, by the mercy of Nityananda, you can get one such a sadhu who is elevated, realized soul, as good. Then, Sajati Rasa Snigde, Shadu Sango Shatubari. It is 100% beneficial. Shadu Shango Shatobari. Shatobari means 100 and 100 times is, you know, important. Very, 100 and 100 more important. Sajati Rasa Snigde, Shadu Shango Shatobari. This Rupaka Sempa is writing. So if you can realize, then don't run here and there to get more and more information. I already told someday before. Those who are going to think, in Hindi Katha I was speaking. Those who are going to think, those who are going to think that Gauriya Bhajan in our Gauriya Mat is incomplete. Those who are going to think our Gauriya Mat Bhajan, Gauriya Bhajan, Gauriya Mat is incomplete. So I'll, I'll have to learn more from outside. They are called Mayavadi. They are called Mayavadi in Hindi Katha I told many times. I cannot think Rupa Goswami Path giving me some incomplete. I cannot think that Jiva Goswami Path giving me some incomplete. I cannot think that Sanatana Goswami speaking some. Baladev Gita Goswami, Bhakti Thakur. Oh, they are not allowing me. Hey, don't do bhajan this. They are speaking. So that doesn't mean Gauriya Bhajan is incomplete. So you want to add something. You're going to add something. You you want to you want to add something with this conception 
that Gauriya Bhajan is itself incomplete. This is called Mayavadi. It's called Mayavadi. You should think, you should realize, you should believe that our Bhajan is complete today or tomorrow. When Naraji Maharaj wanted to know all the secret Lila Vilas of Radha Govindo, Ashtokalin Lila, from Sadashiv. Sadashiv, you know Sadashiv? Sadashiv! Sadashiv speaking, I cannot speak all in details. I can speak something, but all, all detailed information, if you like to get all detailed information, then you will have to approach Binda Devi. I cannot speak. A very secret. Then I can come across this, you know, because Naraji Maharaj, his kunda, one kunda is there, near Kusum Sarabha, just opposite. I can go, do parikram gradually. Mentally, we can do parikram. <coughs> Mentally, if you can do parikram, you, if you are, if you are, if you are getting to get, if you are going to get support, because mental parikrama everybody cannot do. Mental parikrama means you have to see clearly. Those who have seen this kind of power, they can see clearly. They can feel they are in Bindavan, Radha Kund. Not that they imagine, oh, some kunda is there. Not there. Directly they can feel. They are, they are just standing near kunda. This kind of direct feeling should be. Then, if you can do Dham Parikram, you can get abnormal result, excellent result. But who can do? If you have your power, this kind of power, by the help of Harinam, you can do Harinam and go Parikram and think about Bhagavan Sri Krishna. Big problem. People are so lazy, they don't like to apply their, you know, they like to, they are, they are less interested to apply all their energy. Oh, who can is headache, Maharaj? I can take rest better. <laughs> who can do? Eh? Oh. Who can do? This way, they are less interested. But if you can practice by the mercy of Guru Vaishnava, if you can get this kind of habit, then big power can come. Big power can come. Oh, abnormal power. So, Naraji Maharaj, by the advice of so, Naraji Maharaj, by the advice of Shadashiv, going to pray unto the lotus feet of Binda, Oh Devi, you help me. I like to know all Ashtakalin Lila, Ajay. Binda Devi was not ready. Oh, well, what you can do? No, you please you know, teach me. You help me. Binda Devi first giving warning. I can show you. Present Acharya there, what they are speaking. And what is written? I am speaking everything from document, from Sastra. I can show you. Pindadu is speaking, well, it's very secret. Very secret. It should not be opened. Pindadu is speaking. But they speaking, it is open to all. In market also I can do. Simply you can go through the books. Prakito Ras Sato Dushani. Prakito Ras, material laws, material rasa have hundreds of defects. Popat right. You can buy one uh, book in the bookstore, our bookstore also may be available. Prakita Ras, material Ras is contaminated with hundreds of defects. Popat writing. Keshamara writing. Writing. To prove that this Rasa Sattva is top secret, it should not be opened in front of common public. Not. Many evidence, many documents I already give you in course of my discussion. So many documents I already gave you before, you can remember. So you see, Pindadevi speaking, it is top secret. It should not be open in front of public. Well, I can, well, I can help you. Then Naraji Maharaj started and uh, austerities and penances. After that, Bindadevi appeared. After that, Bindadevi appeared. He is going to speak about his own tremendous desire. Bindadevi, okay, but it's very secret. Okay, I can, I can 
give you some clue. You go and take bath in Sharavar. Then coming, Binda Devi is speaking all secrecy. It is very secret, it should not be open. Because material people, they have some material rasa, material enjoyment, they, they, they cannot come out successful and they can commit offence. So be careful. Bindadev is speaking, you should be very careful, don't open in front. This way, if you go on discussing about the gravity of Dhamma, I can also discuss tomorrow and day after tomorrow all, after that I can start. First of all, Bindavan, all deities, after that, from where you can start Parikram, how to do, so many things actually. You can feel enjoyment. If you mentally can move with me. Anyway, when I'm going to discuss, I will have to move there, na? I have to go Bhuteshwar, here, there. <laughs> so naturally I'm going to. So this way we'll have to also go. Anyway, so try to keep patience. I know you are taking trouble to come here again. But what to do? I have no pen. I think about your pen. You are coming long distance, going this, that. So, you see, Shahasya Pattam Kamalam Gokulaksham Mahatpadam Tatkor Nikaram Taddhama Anantanksha Sambhavaha. I like to stop my discussion here because time cannot permit. I like to speak more. So, Banchakal Patarva Sikipasind Vibhasya Patitanang Pavanabhu. Vaishnavya. Try to collect so many documents from, so many documents from Dham, about Dham, Nam. You can get big power established in Bhajan. 